That, that was it for me that night, no? And um, miraculously, miraculously, I survived the accident. And well, honestly, I'm here now, right? Because I need, I need a little bit of assistance, you know? I know that the general public, um, my Belizean people, they will not let me down. Um, I'm trying to locate the same guy, you know, Mr. David Wang. We went to the, to the Supreme Court, and while we were there, um, uh, this guy, we had a warrant, and he never showed up, and, you know, this guy was drunk the night he hit me. He didn't have any insurance on his vehicle, and so we ended up winning the case, no? And the su Supreme Court has given me a warrant for his arrest. However, the reason, the main reason why I came here is because it's been since 2014, you know, this guy has been in hiding. I have a couple friends that I checked to see if we could get other information. And I do believe he's hiding in Belize, maybe not in Belize City because I would have probably already seen him, no? But um, I'd ask the general public to help me in the location of this guy, you know, Mr. David Wang, because I believe that I went through a lot, you know, and. The Supreme Court also um, saw that, no? that I was down, I had a broken leg, the two bones, if you could see the two bones from, from, from my hand, the, the hand is bent for the rest of my life now, right? So um, um, sometimes I have to be on some strong drugs, you know, because the ibuprofen 800 seems to have no effect, you know, with, with, with these pains, especially when the cold front come along, the full moon, I never think I'm going up there. They hate the full moon, you know, but the pain is really, really severe to the point that, you know what, I, um, I just have to bear with it, man. I am grateful to the, to, to the Almighty Father that I am still here because, honestly, I didn't expect to live through that accident that night, no? And um, it, it is very, very painful. There's a lot of things that I had to adjust in my life because I was an outgoing person, you know, before I used to do a lot of hunting, I had to do, um, I used to do a lot of fishing and stuff like that. But now, because of the accident, there's a lot more things that I, I will be unable to do, no? And I just have to adjust towards that, yeah. And yes, this guy's been in hiding, you know, 